beautiful collective and welcome to your general reading i hope you guys can see me because the weather's not the weather the sun's going down so it's a bit dark but it is what it is but welcome to your collective reading um your general reading sorry thank you so much for your likes shares comments and subscribes i appreciate you guys if any of you would like to book a personal reading to purchase anything to make a donation to the channel um or to become a member to gain access to the saucy readings or info on how to do so is in the description box below please remember the energies and the readings can go vice versa okay so only take what resonates feel free to switch agenda switch roles that we got to do and leave the rest i've been saying to all the other signs but i feel like i have to repeat myself is that um i am doing the central readings but every time i keep going to do them it's like there's like several different complications so i'm taking that as an omen like say if you're going to have sex with someone or it's basically don't rush into things because i keep going to do something but then it's like um i keep being stopped you know like something is like stopping me from doing the central readings and it's like you know like even like to to do that type of stuff you have to be in the mood so i just want my members to know people who have who are members to my channel i really appreciate your patience and don't worry when i do your central readings i will make sure they're long or i'll do like a multitude of them okay um i might do fire air water and earth actually um you know but or i might do like go i might go through all signs it just depends okay but i am going to do it the, the energy just has to be right because every time i try to do it it's just like something happens it's like i'm just not meant to focus on the sensual stuff right now okay so that could be like an omen with you maybe you're not supposed to focus on that okay but i am going to to do the readings okay I, I want it to be like right you know and i want to be in like a good energy when i'm putting on the cards because you know how i am i'm not a sexual person so i get really giddy in the in the readings <laughs> but yeah so this is for my beautiful collective so i'm using my french deck so hopefully i remember what the words are if i don't apologies to the french if anyone's watching okay so journey okay so for some of you, you could be going on a journey you could be going on a trip okay I feel like you're going somewhere and the ordeal i remember i feel like that's what that means okay so there could be some type of obstacle or something that is trying to stop you from moving forward this could be people as well trying to stop you from moving forward but i feel like you're moving you're traveling you're you know um you're just moving on okay i'm also getting that somebody's like taking like center stage in the world or somebody could actually be traveling or if you travel you're going to travel somewhere um you're going to um how can i say if you decide to travel or move it's a good decision okay i feel like you're going to gain success in a different environment okay but you're moving on but i feel like it's like obstacles after obstacles or there's something that is quite challenging okay but yeah underneath that we have celebration so i just feel like continue to keep moving forward because i feel like anything to stop you from moving forward someone is going to just try and stop you okay but it's all good okay so for my beautiful collective, my beautiful, beautiful collective. Also, you look beautiful collective. I just feel like you need to, to, to know that. Okay. You could be getting a lot of compliments. But you look beautiful or you look very handsome. All right. So the journey. So it's kind of like the full card okay you're going on a journey you could be going on holiday on vacation or you're just you don't you're just moving forward okay maybe you actually have to go somewhere i just had diversion as well so i'm hearing the bus is on diversion okay so for some of you that could be what it is like you're traveling somewhere and it goes a different way but then when you go a different way you find something else and you're happy that you went okay so this energy just wants to keep coming out whenever this is poured it just keeps coming out so you know we'll just take it because i kept shuffling as you saw and the cards just keep coming out so first we have feisty sexy and passionate so like i said for some of you you're very attractive you could be very passionate about something again my apologies if the screen is going dark it's because the web the the, the lighting is going dark okay but you can still see the cards hopefully and then we have the hair envy which says jealous jealousy spite and cruelty so i feel like people are jealous and spiteful and cruel the same energy that we got in the last reading um because you look really really attractive and that's just facts okay 
and at the bottom of the deck we have the hair crush which says love attraction and feelings yeah so i feel like people are actually um very attracted to you or this is what it is you're very attractive like i said you could be getting a lot of compliments for some of you you could be traveling with your partner or maybe you travel and you meet someone but i just feel like you you're attracting a lot of love interest right now because you're just you're just looking amazing and obviously because you look amazing there's always going to be someone that's just a hater that wants to just bring your energy down and just say something hateful and you just like really like i feel like that's um that is how can i say confirmation that you're doing something right when you just trigger people like i feel like someone is triggered by your look what you do with your hair your clothes your nails like someone is always picking at something someone is so jealous of you like i feel like someone really wishes that they could be you but they can't like someone can't pull off different looks like you um so somebody's just a hateful mean miserable person you're just like wow like i really affect people like this like oh my goodness like i'm just a shit like i feel like you really need to look at yourself like that like look at the way she's looking like oh you like she's just walking like you know my goodness like i just caused so much disruption like really so yeah but really it's because people love you okay or um if there's a lot of obstacles that's going around it's just because maybe there's some there's some type of energy that's trying to stop this love from coming or like i said you're just in this attractive energy you're just attracting a lot of people a lot of things that you want you know what i mean you're just very desirable right now it just is what it is but that's why someone is jealous of you because you're sexy and you're look good okay so just be happy about it man now i mean sometimes you just gotta be like real like i really be bothering people like people really be taking their time out to, to say something like that like, i'm really like i live i feel like you live rent free in somebody's mind like i see someone like sitting down and like paying attention to every little thing that you do like do you know what i mean you're out here like loving up on somebody or um just enjoying yourself enjoying your life you know what i mean you're just like wow what what, what it must be to be a hateful bitch like you know don't even pray for those people don't waste your prayers on them let the divine deal with them i already told you guys karma is coming darling but just expect people to be cool hateful envy envious i said that to leo the other day just expect attacks i feel like when you expect something and then it happens then it's like yeah okay it's just confirmation okay yeah because you're very powerful we have the magician okay it's manipulation as well People just want to manipulate you because they just don't want you to they don't want you to see yourself like this but the, as usual the divine keeps reminding you how much of a bad bitch you are okay or a bad dude okay but with the magician and the um the feisty sexy passionate like oof, you're oozing oozing power and gorgeousness like just oozing now this could be something that you do okay so you could be very skilled okay or well, this could be how you're viewing someone so if this is not like physical attraction this could just be something that you do very well someone just very jealous of your talent or just how in control you are of yourself or you're just very attractive like it just it is what it is you have the emperor i just i feel like it's something to do with your work or your jobs so somebody wants you to somebody wants to knock your confidence to make you feel like you're not good at what it is that you do but you're amazing excuse me so yeah just as i was saying to libra the judgment woman i fuck shit up and i leave like period It's like someone is trying to destroy what you've got going on. So you could be, you could have a lot of people that's like judging you, but they're judging you because you're attractive. You know what I mean? Because ugly people, they don't get attention. So just, just know that. Like, if people like keep, keep saying shit to you, it's just like, you know what? Like, why am I bothering you though? Like, I just feel like, yeah, justice because you're balanced, you're fair, you're beautiful. And again, I mentioned justice before, karma, darling. Don't worry about it. This is why these people are in this energy. Like, I, I feel like people are stuck in their head. It's like people don't understand. I feel like people can't see their own miserable behavior. They don't understand why, like, certain things are not manifesting for them. They don't understand that they're living a life of karma because they're, like, a miserable, hateful bitch. Yeah. Underneath that, we have the tower. They don't want to hear it. The divine is like, I'm, I'm warning you. And she's like, I don't want to hear. It's all good, though. We have justice, darling. So you will get justice I feel like your justice is coming in the form of beauty and love and sex appeal okay because it's like you know someone could be mean to you and then like you're laid up with your partner and your partner's just like babe like kissing all up on you like spoiling you just reminding you like are you listening to those dickheads it's like no you know what i mean like because to me if you're loved up do you think you've got time to be like hating on someone like so obviously people are miserable and bitter in their lives okay 
But it's okay. The judgment woman is coming for these envious people. Don't worry about it, darling. If somebody does anything cruel to you or anything out of spite, don't worry. Like, someone is just very bitter and very alone. Or maybe you've moved on and someone can't accept it. Okay, but either way, this is looking amazing to me. Sorry, it's really hot. It's really hot today, ma'am. Okay, this is for my beautiful collective. My beautiful collective. What else have we got? The two of cups. I told you, you're like loved up. Or you will be. Could be dealing with a Cancerian. Or people love you. Or somebody loves you. Or you are pouring love into yourself. Period. I'm just getting the power of love. Like, you know when someone's operating from love. Like, because... We're just not even going to get into that. But love is the highest frequency right now. So if you're operating from this energy and you're being nice and kind to people, you're good. Yeah, the sun, because you're just shining solutions in your life. Like, no problems, just solutions. Okay, I said that before. It's like, it's, it's just the way that you shine and you just keep getting brighter and brighter and better and better. Period. Period. Yeah, like I said, for some of you, you're moving on. You could be moving to a hot country or you're, like I said, you're going on vacation or you're moving towards a Leo. So what is the envy and the hatred? The six of um, wealth. So it could be a Taurus that's hating on you. I feel like someone's hating on you because you're getting support. Or what someone needs to be doing is supporting you, but they're, they're, they're being mean on purpose. But I think it's because you're getting support. The universe is spoiling you. Because that it's like love, money, generosity. I just feel like it's going to be different for different people. But I just feel like you're getting something that you want. And someone is just upset about that. It is what it is, ma'am. Yeah. And there's the A of passion. Good news coming. Fast results. Things are picking up pace. Someone is very, very attracted to you. Also, I'm just getting like love at first sight or a lot of communication going back and forth with you and this person or just like rapid growth. So, of course, something is growing in your life. You're moving on or you're moving forward. There's going to be someone that's mad, but it just, it is what it is, man. We don't have time to worry about this energy anymore because I'm just in such a good mood. Like, I just feel so much positivity. Even with the um, Envy card, it's like, this is a positive card. It's like, we just, we don't have time for that. You know what I mean? So please clarify the two of emotions. The Temperance. So double Sagittarius energy here, Taurus and Cancerian, but it could be any sign. But the Temperance, yeah, balance. I feel like somebody is just perfect for you. Somebody's just in sync with you or you are in sync with someone else. Just gorgeous energy, man. Somebody's just so angelic, yeah. And ending to bullshit. I feel like you're transforming, you're changing, you're transitioning. It's just beautiful to watch. Yeah, and the, um, the seven of cups. Yeah, someone is confused. And again, like I was saying, someone is delusional here. Like It's almost like someone doesn't realize that they're cool, they're envious and they're spiteful. Like, I feel like someone feels like them being, them being spiteful or cruel is, like, supportive. And you're just like, what? But someone is confused. And it's like, how are you getting all of this support? support or how are you doing this? Or, you know, someone is, like, delusional here. Or they're trying to create confusion. But Sorry, guys, but she was full again. But, yeah, they're trying to create confusion. Um, but we're just not going to focus on them because, yeah, the fool is at the bottom of the deck. You're free. You're free to do what you want. You're free to go where you, wherever you want. Love who you what, love, who you want, what you want. Just do what you want. I just feel like you're completely detached. This is what these energies are kind of like giving me. Like you're just, and I'm sure I said that earlier. The journey, I said it's like the fool card. You're completely detached from a situation or from people. I just feel like you're just in love with life or with yourself with something that you're doing. And someone else is trying to figure out how they can sabotage your support or how they can fuck something up that you're doing. But you're just focused on being balanced and being free. Yeah, and going towards your future because your future looks bright. And there's the justice card again. So, you know what I mean? Like, karma is around you, man. There's just nothing that you need to be worried about right now. I just feel like people are just worried about you, but you're you're not worried. Like, yeah, a relationship wanted to flip over. You could be in a beautiful relationship. Or just something is coming towards you and you just have no idea what it is. But yeah, healer. So I feel like you're healed. And it's it's obvious, okay? And intuitive is at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, some of you could be readers, spiritual practitioners. Okay, maybe there's people are hating because you're just good at what you do. Or you're a very sexy practitioner. Okay, so people just can't handle that, you know. But it is what it is. But I feel like intuitively you can feel something. Or there's going to be a love that comes towards you that's just really going to heal your heart, okay? Like I said, if it's not a love interest, it could just be a love of something. It could be something creative of all of these ones or something athletic. 
And I embrace change as an opportunity for growth. Yes. You're embracing, you're changing, or you're expanding. And you know, people, they don't like change because they can't change, but you can. And I allow myself to experience joy and laughter. That's what I'm getting. Because I feel like that. I feel so like happy. So I just feel like you're just happy. You're happy and you're healed. And it just makes people feel some type of way. But it doesn't, don't worry about that. I'm also getting that someone loves to see you smile or someone's going to make you smile, okay? This is like my favorite card in this deck. And it's crazy because I was shuffling the cards earlier and it landed on happy ever after. So beautiful energy collective. So yeah, just keep doing you. There's just bit of people around you that are just mad. They're always going to be mad. They're always going to be mad. That's just what these people do. It's just a recycled behavior of illusions and confusions. Like people don't change, but you're changing. And it's gorgeous, okay? Don't worry about anything else, darling, okay? I first feel like, I feel like you're receiving good karma, and like I said, people are just, they're going through towers. They're taking it out on you. It is what it is. Keep doing you, boo-boo, okay? Toodles.